each other's infirmities and weaknesses, to comfort each other in sickness, trouble, and sorrow, to share with each other all gladness, and to convert your private happiness into a common blessing. Craig and Kalilani, is it in this spirit, for this purpose, that you have come here today to be joined in holy matrimony? Craig, you would be blessed to have Kalilani as your wife. You are to so love her that the acceptance, understanding, and support she finds in your love will provide her the security to express her inner beauty and light. By seeing the good in this woman, you give her the strength to create more goodness in the world. With this understanding, Craig, do you take Kalilani to be your wife and do you pledge of faithfulness to her in all love and honor in devotion and tenderness, forsaking all others, to live with her and cherish her in the holy union of marriage? I do. Kaleilani, you would be blessed to have Craig as your husband, you are to so love him, that he may find within himself a greater sense of who he is going to be by seeing the good in this man, and by being loyally devoted to him, you give him the strength to stand for what is just and right and good in the world. With this understanding, Kalila, do you take Craig to be your husband and do you pledge your faithfulness to him in all love and honor and devotion and tenderness forsaking all others to live with him in church in the holy union of marriage? I do. The holy union of marriage is nurtured and sustained by love. In turn, it is your steadfast commitment that makes a love grow deep. God's Word teaches us through the Bible that love is patient, love is kind, love is not envious or boastful, is not arrogant or rude, love does not insist on its own way, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs, it does not delight in wrongdoing but rejoices with the truth. Love bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things endures all things. Love never fails. I pray to take you Kalilani into my life. To be my beloved wife. To have and to hold. From this day forward. This day forward, and I promise before my family and friends to be your loving, faithful husband. To be your loving and faithful husband. For better or for worse. For better or for worse. In joy and in sorrow. In joy and in sorrow. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. Take you pray into my life. I, Kalilani, take you pray into my life. To be my beloved husband. To be my beloved husband. To have to. To have to. Your rings represent the eternal nature of true love, as the circles are never ending, so let your commitment to this union be never ending. And as you wear your rings, let them remind you that from now on, wherever you may be, wherever you may go, you will always be encompassed by each other's love and care. <coughs> Bless, O Lord, the giving of these rings, that they who wear them may live in your peace and continue in your favor all the days of their lives. May these rings be signs of promises fulfilled and of faithful loving. With this ring, I be wed. With this ring, I be wed. And join my life with yours. And join
enjoying my life with yours. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. And all that I have. Now I am forever. With this ring, I be wed. Enjoying my life with yours. Enjoying my life with yours. With all that I am. With all that I am. And all that I have. With, and all that I have. Now and forever. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we thank you for the sacred and tender ties which Craig and Kalilani have now taken upon themselves. Help them to remember always the deep love they feel for each other on this day. Guide them in working that love into practical things so nothing can divide them. As they meld their hearts into one spirit, we pray that you give them words gentle and kind and hearts always ready to ask forgiveness as well as willing to forgive. Dear God, we put this marriage into your hands and may the benediction of heaven crown their happiness on earth. In Christ our Savior. Amen. Craig and Kalilani, receive this blessing. In your new life together, may the Lord bless you and keep you. The Lord make his face to shine upon you and be gracious unto you and give you and your house peace, love, and contempt. Now and the life everlasting. Amen. And now, because the two of you have willingly given yourselves to become united as one and have promised to share the joy of all your days together, it is with great honor and pleasure that I pronounce you husband and wife in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Okay. You may seal your vows with a kiss. Congratulations. Friends and family, thank you for joining us in this happiest of occasions. Craig and Kalilani will be signing the marriage documents. Following that, they need to do their formal family picture. So please hold your best wishes for the reception. Thank you and God bless each one of you. Oh,